Goodwill Community Foundation, creating opportunities for a better life. Have you ever downloaded or saved a file only to have trouble finding it later? Trying to track down a misplaced file can be frustrating or even stressful. But if this ever happens to you, don't panic. The file is probably still on your computer, and there are a few good ways to find it. Let's take a look at some of the techniques you can use to find your files. If you recently edited the file you need, you can try looking for it in the Recent Places folder. Open Windows Explorer, also known as File Explorer, then select Recent Places. A list of recently used folders and settings will appear. Try looking in some of the recently used folders to see if you can locate your file. If you see the file you need, just double-click to open it. By default, your computer will place downloaded files in a specific folder called the Downloads folder. This is the first place you should look if you're having trouble finding a file that you downloaded from the Internet, like a photo attached to an email. To view the Downloads folder, open Windows Explorer, then select Downloads. A list of your recently downloaded files will appear. And again, if you see the file you need, just double-click to open it. Other good places to check for a misplaced file are the default folders. When you open File Explorer, the default folders may appear here. But if you don't see them, you can open them from the sidebar on the left side of the window. If you don't specify a location when saving a file, Windows will place certain types of files in the default folders. For example, if you're looking for a photo, try looking in the Pictures folder. Or, if you think you may have deleted the file by mistake, it may still be in the Recycle Bin. Double-click the Recycle Bin icon on the desktop to open it. If you find the file you need, click and drag it to the desktop to remove it from the Recycle Bin. If you are still struggling to find a file, you can search for it. The process is basically the same no matter what version you're using. To search for a file, click the Start button, then just begin typing a file name or keywords. If you see what you're looking for, just click the file or folder to open it. Finally, once you've located the file you've been looking for, you may want to move it to a place that will make it easier to find in the future. For example, if it's a file you use frequently, you can move it to your desktop. And the next time you want to open that file, you'll be able to find it quickly and easily.